For Action News, I'm Anna Samovska. Numerous drugs have been tried in the fight against obesity, some affecting neurons in the brain, others acting on the liver. But one drug in particular, Orlistat, focuses on your waistline. A recent analysis from the UK examined 39 studies on the effect of Orlistat in waist circumference among obese people. Researchers found that after six months of treatment, people who took the drug had a significant decrease in waist circumference than those who had taken a placebo by as much as 2.6 centimeters after a year of treatment. Action's Dr. Ruth Kava says the news is hopeful, but other factors should be considered. It's interesting because in this particular report, the researchers looked at waist circumference, which is an indication of what's called central obesity. And that's important because it's when you have a lot of fat in the abdomen, that has more deleterious effects than if you had it, say, on the legs or the arms or somewhere else on the body. And the differences weren't huge, and they got a little bit smaller after a year, but it's still indicative of some effectiveness of the drug. And Lord knows we've been trying to get an effective anti-obesity drug for a long time. And the benefit with Orlistat, in my mind, is that it's not a centrally acting drug. It doesn't really act on the brain or the central nervous system. It only acts on the gastrointestinal tract. So you're less likely to get some of the negative side effects that we've seen with other obesity drugs. So on the whole, this is a hopeful sign, but it is never going to obviate the need for controlling exercise and lifestyle. Because like everything else, if you want to beat the drug, if you want to eat around it, you can do that. But it's hopeful. For this story and others, head to our website, aksha.org. While you're there, you can sign up for your daily dose of news delivered right to your inbox.